Hey guys, it's Britt, and today I am doing the new to booktube tags tag by Trina from Between Chapters, and I will link her original video below. And yes, I am wearing a Snuggie because it's cold in here, and I can't find a blanket, and I just want to move this one here out of my face. Okay, on to the questions. Number one. Where are you joining us from? I am joining you guys from America, but more specifically, Northern New Jersey. And I don't care who you ask. Nobody, nobody, not even in South Jersey, says Joyzy. Nobody. It's, it's Jersey. Jersey. Okay. Number two. How old are you? I'm currently 23 years old, and I will be turning 24 on March 21st. Number three. Why did you join BookTube? I joined BookTube because I needed a distraction from life. My brother just moved into his college dorm, and we're really close. He's my younger brother. He, this is his first year of college, and I take online courses so I don't dorm or anything like that but also my best friend is joining the Coast Guard and I'm really proud of her I really really am but it's gonna be a long eight weeks of boot camp and when you talk to somebody every day from the time you wake up you the time you go to sleep and suddenly you're cut off from them entirely it's it's tough and when she goes off on the September 27th I'm really gonna need something to do that isn't school so that's that's why I joined booktube I'm not gonna get emotional Again, I already did that in a video. Okay, number four. What is the meaning behind your channel name? If it is something other than your name. It is not something other than my name, but if you follow me on Twitter, which I will also link, it is girl on Kindle Fire. And that is because I have a Kindle Fire. I am also quite a big fan of The Hunger Games. Number five, what types of books do you read want to talk about here? I read a lot of young adult, and recently there's kind of been a, a stigma of adults reading young adult, and I think that's ridiculous because it doesn't matter what age you are as long as you're reading and you're happy. That's what's important. But mostly young adult. With some adult fantasy sprinkled in there. I'm quite a big fan of Game of Thrones, so I'll be talking about that a lot. So number six, who are some of your favorite authors? Some of my favorite authors include, obviously, George R. R. Martin, J.K. Rowling, and Maggie Stiebotter. Also, I recently really got into Alex Garland, who wrote The Beach, and I really enjoyed that book. I did a full review on it. I'll link that below as well. Uh, blah, blah, blah. I'm losing track. Number seven. What is the last book you read? The last book I read was Cinder by Marissa Meyer. What are you currently reading? I am currently reading The Savage Song by V.E. V. E. Schwab. Number nine. What do you use as bookmarks? I use whatever I can get my hands on. I use scraps of paper. I use actual bookmarks. If you see that bag back there, 
I use scraps of fabric. I hate when things go to waste. So whatever I can use as a bookmark, I use as a bookmark. Number 10, show us your current TBR pile. Okay, so these are all ebooks and I've been having trouble getting my ebooks to show up well on screen. So I'm just gonna read them off to you. Let me just pull up my Kindle. Okay. I should have mentioned Victoria. Okay, my current TBR is The Archived by Victoria Schwab, Unbound by Victoria Schwab, A Gathering of Shadows by V.E. Schwab, Vicious by V.E. Schwab, Harper Lee Goes at a Watchman, The Before Now and After Then by Peter Mon, whose channel I will link below, Joe Hill, The Fireman, when We Collided by Emerly Lord, The Kill Order by James Dasher, and The Fever Code when that comes out. I believe A Night of the Seven Kingdoms by George R. R. Martin. And let's see, what do I have on Audible? A Clash of Kings by George R. R. Martin. Neil Gaiman's Trigger Warning. Fight Club by Chuck Palahniuk. Hmm. Fangirl by Rainbow Rowell. Carry On by Rainbow Rowell. And I think that's it. I'm not going to do all those in September because that would... Well, it's probably doable, but school starts for me. So I'm going to kind of break that up a little bit. But who knows what will happen. Number 11. Which do you prefer, hardcover or paperback? I prefer hardcover because I am disabled and it's difficult me, difficult for me to hold uh, paper mass market paperbacks open. And I'm kind of paranoid about the spines cracking on paperbacks. So I don't. I, uh, it's not that I just like paperbacks, I just prefer hardbacks. Ebook or physical books? I'm gonna get a lot of slack for this. Currently, and this might change, I prefer ebooks because come the winter months, my hand is, my left hand is going to get very, very stiff and it will become very, very, very difficult for me to hold a physical book. So as of the current time of filming, I'm going to say ebooks. Just because they're convenient, I don't have a waiting time, I'm addicted to that one-click button on Amazon. Honestly. Number 12. Oh, I forgot. Owning or borrowing books. I prefer to... I, I don't really have a preference. If it's on my library, I'll, I'll read it. And if I really enjoy it, I'll go out and buy it. But I currently, I'm a college student and classes and books are expensive. So whatever I can check out a library, I'll check out a library. And if I really enjoy it, I'll buy it. But I don't really have a preference. Number 12. What book or series got you into reading? Harry Potter by J.K. Rowling. 13. How did you discover BookTube? I discovered BookTube about two years back when I was looking up videos for NaNoWriMo and I stumbled upon a channel named Kytastic, Katie Tastic, but Kat from, I'll link her below. That's how, that's how I found BookTube. Number 14. What challenges do you think you'll face with your own channel? I think the biggest challenge I will face with my channel is the opinions that I have and 
they're pretty unpopular opinions, and that's another tag I'll be doing. So subscribe to that if you want to check it out. I also really like languages, so I want to review textbooks pertaining to languages, but I don't think that's going to interest a lot of people. And also, I don't have the highest quality equipment, but I'm, I'm okay with that. It, it will become a gradual process. I will gradually invest money into it. Fifteen. Where else can we find you, Link Up? Okay. I have a Goodreads, which I will link below. And I mentioned my Twitter, which I will also link down below. I have an Instagram, but it's not a book Instagram. It's kind of a personal Instagram. And I don't really feel comfortable sharing it because it's, it's for my friends and family. But if you want me to make a bookstagram, I will gladly just comment below. Okay. I'm gonna go, guys. I love you. I had fun doing this tag. Thank you, Trina. Okay. Love you guys. Bye. Like, comment, and subscribe, because it makes my day. Okay. I'm leaving for real now. Bye.